Hello guys, it is Mitch. What is up? Today I'm here to teach you guys how to jailbreak your iPhone. Now, I have a iPhone 4S and it is on iOS um 8.1.2. Now, what you're going to have to do is go and search jailbreak me. Once you're there, it should be the third one, Pangu 8. Click that. Once you're here, you're going to select your iDevice. Mine's an iPhone uh, 4S on iOS 8.1.2. The base brand, just select that because I don't really know what the base brand is. And Windows, and then check your iDevice. So your iPhone is jailbreakable. So you press, um, you press what it asks you the so for the software. The first one should be the best for you. Where are we? <laughs> Uh, so then you're gonna click Windows, and I need Tag G version English, the newest version. Select that, and then press Download Software. Now you're gonna want to back up your iDevice before you do this, and I've already done that. So just in case anything happens or you don't want the jailbreak, you can just um, get rid of it by um, back. Restoring the backup. There we go. Then you're gonna open up. Make sure your iDevice is plugged in. I will also have the link in the description for this website. Huh. It worked. Like, <laughs> um. Let's try that again. Take your All right, I'll be back in a second to figure out what's going on with this. What am I doing? All right, I found where to get it. I just um searched up this and I uh went to this website. I will also put this this in the description, not this, because this just tells you it doesn't work. This is what it looks like by the way, so shit, I just exited whatever. Download. But I will be putting this in the description, not the other one. I got it. That was right. <laughs> so wait for this to finish. Oh, so excuse my fan if you can hear that. Alright, so now it should come up like this. Are you fucking kidding Alright, I ran into these problems a lot. Uh, don't worry, it doesn't really harm. I just gotta put this in here. I'm gonna have to download it. What the? What? So I have to open an Internet Explorer because Chrome, like, friggin' blocks everything. I don't know how to get bypa bypass that. If you could leave in the description, if you know how to bypass it, that would be great because I don't. Like using Internet Explorer for things like this. Why do I have people? So I'll come back to my next step. All right, we finally got it. Um, so you're gonna open up this. Finally, here we go. All righty, so checking jailbreak environment and stuff. Alright, so you're gonna want to install Cydia. What are you? <laughs> uh, not? So Cydia always comes with it. It always have that check there. You can't unselect it or anything. That's what a jailbreak basically is. So before you start, turn that off. I just turned that off because it told me to for my backup. So here we go. 
So you're gonna click start. And uh, it's going to do do its thing. Injecting. Oh, that's that's creepy. That is. I have to say, jailbreaking seems kind of creepy. In a way, it just it just gives you like it gives you the good feeling at first, but like what the you can manage your storage. Storage almost full. What the fuck? My phone just turned on. Said you can manage your storage in storage settings. It gives that good feeling at first, but like, like I just said, it's after that feels bad. Um, now I did jailbreak my iPod. I used that Poisex Spawn thing. I really, really liked Poisex Spawn. I felt really good with using that. This one, I'm not too sure about feeling good about it. Oh, and there goes my phone. So when it turns on, I will screen record and show you it. Um, so yeah. It has the Apple symbol and stuff going on. So I'll just wait for it to turn on. Um, so thank you for using Taggy to Tyag Jailbreak Tools. Please enjoy your time now. Thank you. So then you can just hit close when you're done. Now I just hope this never took up too much storage because, um, you know, like, I have a 5 gig. Well, like, 8 gig, but it comes with 5 gig. Like, oh, why are you here? <laughs> It's gonna come on. Look! The fuck? <laughs> it vibrated, so it scared me. I'm oh, sorry. Okay. Um. Tell us. There we go. All right. And the jailbreak is successful, so I'm gonna get on my iPod, sorry, iPhone, and I'm gonna show you what it'd be like. Uh, stop doing that! Alrighty, so this is my phone, as you can see over here. We got Cydia, and it's all jailbroken, it's all good, it's all Gucci, it's all everything, it's all everything, everything, everything. So I got, I got this K. 3k thing I don't know what that is but apparently it's like Japanese stuff or something so it's gonna prepare the file system steal exit when complete so I'll just uh, finish this up with you guys and all this does this is have a nice little talk so uh yeah it's a pretty nice day it's a it's a snow day too so uh yeah home time <laughs> Uh, it's snowing outside and uh, lots of snow in Canada. Good times in Canada, good times, good days and everything. <sighs> so how you doing? You doing good? You doing good, that's good. That's really good. Yeah. Alright, so it is finished. Uh, my iPod had a little reset. Well, restart, not reset. Like, reset, like, like restart. <laughs> and yeah, so Cydia is all here. Everything is good. Everything is working fine. And it's it's pretty cool. I, I will enjoy this jailbreak. Um, got the nice up-to-date one. Everything is good. And now, this is what I always go straight to doing. Oh, wait, no, I don't have it yet. <laughs> Um, so yeah, um, I did have to transfer all my things, my sources, onto here. But anyways, make sure, if you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, share with your friends. And if you want a jailbreak, just follow these steps, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.